Hold on, amigos, come on, it's time. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, this is an English channel. All right. Uh, today we're playing a game of a game called Flashing Lights with the game with a new update. So I will be going over a few things. I'll be going over the past few updates we missed. I will be going. Oh, by the way, the past few updates are mainly on the EMT. I'll just be going over the EMT updates for now. But anyway, then I'll also be talking about the roadmap. And yeah. So yeah, you'll get to see here. So for the EMG, we have a bunch of new stuff here. Let me just get my back. Oh Jesus. Okay, why is this so loud? No, I'm turning off the engine. I don't want the engine on. Hell no. Anyway, for the EMT, we have a bunch of new stuff. We're going to items. We have uh, some new stuff in the med kit. I have a fracture kit. And I don't think we have anything else. Yeah, we don't have anything else. So, let's go over the med kit. Or not. So, we're gonna. I'm gonna have to get a call here for the med kit. Let me turn down my. Yeah, I, I want to respond to that. Uh, Settings. Alright. Yeah, I have a call there. Is it just me or did the interior for this ambulance change? I have a big feeling it did. So yeah, we have some new stuff. I'll show you in a moment. Once I get to the scene, which I should yeah, we'll just do that. Okay, I'll be there and yeah, see you in a minute. So meanwhile, let's go over some things. Or not, actually, I'm gonna do that. Yeah. I really have a feeling this ambulance got new in I have a big feeling this ambulance got new in Look, like, I don't remember having all this. And the great Chevy thingy. Over there. You know what this game needs? A Chevy Tahoe. Or Chevy Impala. I really like a Chevy Tahoe. I'd love to see it happen. And the SWAT team, that would also be very cool. But, for the SWAT team, I'd say they'd probably fire them and add it more closer to the end of the game. Okay, let's go here. So, I'm gonna grab the med kit, since now I can show you how it's new in it. Oh. <laughs> of course, we're aggressive red driver, god damn it. It's a woman. So, we have bandages here. That's all that's really new in here. That's all that's really new. Yeah. So, then let's hope this person has a fracture so I can show you how the fracture kit. And I hope that I can use the bandage here. We'll get to use that at some point. <laughs> Oh, come on! I, okay, I'll just show you the band. Or not. Kinda mad about that. Now, let, let me grab it. Well, uh, you, know, I'll, I'll, you know, I'll just call transport. Screw this. Calling transport, I'm not gonna transport them. It's gonna take too long. Let's do, let's do this transport. Oh yeah, and then you're just gonna say in my comments, "Oh, Dom, you're lazy, eh? You're lazy, legit. You should have done that. You should have transported him." Well, I'm not here to do it properly now. I'm I'm just here to ha to goddamn check out the update. Do we have the same ambulance? No, I feel like mine front of mine is a bit longer than that. That's all I think that's changed. That's Unconscious person, that's what Now that is one of the calls where you have to use said new tools. Uh, let me just drift and contact ambulance because this game's legit.
Wait, no, four. It's gonna be Gen Four. <laughs> the first update in July was language update, I think. And the second one was EMS Part One. So that's basically Banches, Fracture Kit, and the new cars and stuff like that. I'll read on what EMS Part Two is um, once I get to show you the old. Then the next one I'll talk about that once we get to that. Right now we're going to be en route to the call code 3 for an unconscious person. What the hell? What the hell? I'm going to have to look at my, f at my footage and see what happens because I'm me confused. <laughs> Roadmaster, legit. The hell? Let me just go to help settings here. Help command. Yep, that's that's all good. And this game's legit, and you can do that. I wonder what codes would you respond code. I'm pretty sure it said we can speak to the witnesses here. I guess not. Well, get the hell out of my way. Okay, I'm gonna get myself a medic bag. Let's hope I get to use the death food. I get to medic you? No, sad. Okay, I'm gonna inspect them. Which takes some time. Okay, that's totally legit. Legit how you have to inspect them. Excuse me. It's legit how you have to inspect them. But the more legit thing is you don't know if something even happened. Perform CPR. Let me. Alright. Loads. Perform CPR. Please let me use. Please tell me you're bleeding. Or you have a fractured bone or something, I don't know. I just want to use the new stuff. <laughs> Death it. Ah, my eye. Technical death. Legit. That is totally legit. Yeah, that's just. Yeah. Shock. Huh. Shock pad, so I'm gonna need them. So many wires. Yes, I get to use the new stuff. Fracture kit. Okay, this is getting really in depth. You have to do a lot. So the fracture kit, fracture kit is an orange bag as you can see. So you just plop it right there. Or wherever it tells you to plop it. Can I place more? No. I think it's just to stabilize the person. Well, I'm gonna be lazy here. I don't pass Okay, I'm not gonna show off the bandages. It's been long enough. Okay, let's get to the road map and that stuff. So if I go into my steam, I should have to. Or not. Never mind, I do. Right there. Okay. So let's 
let's talk about the update first. When it okay. So the new stuff here is when when you're in the EMS multiplayer can revive Sean injured players, which is very good. When Sean injured in single player you can now call an EMS NPC to revive you. So check that out in the next video because I'm not gonna be switching teams. When Sean injured in multiplayer yet yeah, Retrieve menu added, revive menu added, so that you can choose to call for EMS assist or to respawn at station when Sean injured. Seven new languages support traditional Chinese, French, Dutch, Swedish, Danish, Brazilian, Portuguese. Brazilian, Portuguese, Portuguese seems legit. It's just Portuguese, I'm pretty sure, isn't it? Polish, yay, Polska. Clear the number of Sean, an unconscious person call updated to include a bystander EMS NPC. So, there are some fixes here, y'all can read them if you want. Hey, anyway, let's get into the good stuff here. In July! In July, we're going to be getting the police computer and database. Or, or, or how <laughs> <laughs> or how they describe it. NPC profile search. Legit. So most likely, in a real police database, um, what would it really happen is, you, first of all, on a computer, you have multiple options. You can search via, you can search the plate, see if the, uh, if, see if the, um, owner of the vehicle, see if the, See if the vehicle's stolen. If it's stolen, it will pop up. See if the vehicle has valid registration and insurance and all that good stuff, you know. So it's basically that. You'd get to search, and it will also say if the it would also say if the owner has warrants and stuff like that. Then you get to search IDs. So basically, identification cards. Um. So that's basically an ID card is where you have your name, driver's license, stuff like that, you know. Uh, that's what I'm pretty sure it is. Well, anyway, it's basically, basically, you get their name. After getting their name, you go back to the car. You search up the, you go into the com computer database. You search them up. Uh, so you type their name into the computer. And then you see if they have any warrants they have valid a valid driver's license a gun permit and stuff like that and then and then another thing you'd have on the computer is calls in real life calls would come up on the computer and give you more details that's what I'm pretty sure happens I know that's how it's I know I've seen that in games before and there could be some more stuff on the police database but we don't know if that if they're going to be adding all that stuff into the database. Don't know what is that right there. See that right above the picture. What is that? Tell me down below. In August, it's just going to be controller support, which yeah, I guess that's good for any PS4 players, Xbox players, and stuff like that. But they could have just added the controller support in like a July update, and then on August they could have the September update, and on September they can have something else. You know what I mean? Okay, then on September they have a functional fire ladder truck. So, what that's gonna mean, most likely, the thing, let me just grab my snip here, the ladder you see over here, that will be able to go up so you can have it like that instead of having it like that with the fire truck down below yeah like that you can move it you can move it over here like that like that basically anyone. No. New fire callouts. 
possibly what I what I'd expect from the fire call outs probably hmm, uh, fires on top of a building. So let me let me just draw a quick diagram here. <laughs> okay. So there's gonna be a so fires on top of so what I'd expect is to have a building like okay, that's not what I want to do. To have a building like right here. Then a fire top here or maybe fires in a window where you have to use the ladder truck to get in or maybe like fires coming out like that that's a bit much but still um maybe maybe an m maybe an mba eh, eh. <laughs> maybe an mba eh. where there's Fire, where, where there's a victim inside both the vehicles and there's fire coming out and you have to put out the fire before the victims get hurt and then treat to the victims that's what I'd expect of that further EMS improvements I do not know what that means well what they mean by that okay let's see what else do we have here so let me just let me just go into heat now Hit and run, that's nice. But I'm not gonna be going on to that because I wanna I wanna check out this. And I have some there we go. EMS part one. So EMS part one was first. Uh blah, 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 let's go into here. So th this just added the down here. On con the, they added the call on contract person, which we done. EMS fracture kit, so it, to use in broken bones, yeah. Yes. <coughs> yeah, let's call out hit and run. If you don't, a hit and run is basically where a car hits a pedestrian or a different car and flees from the scene. Bandages for shot wounds treatments or active bleeding wounds, etc. Yeah, let's call out a person sh with a shot wounds. Yeah, and EMS players can now take care of NPCs hit by a vehicle or shot while. Holding the med back, med bag. What? Oh, 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 okay. Added hydrants to all gas stations. So, as you can see, it's pretty nice. I'm gonna be, hope I'm gonna be ending the video here with my. L let me just space these things up. They, they said they fixed the invisible. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm gonna report that very quick to the devs. The hell is my mouse at? Let's just go on to let's go on to the pages. Update page. Uh, where is it here? Fixes broke it. Okay, that. Okay, never mind, I'm, I can't really sign in here. Okay. Okay. So yeah, I'll be ending the video here. Hope y'all enjoyed. Now I wonder if I can get into this ambulance. You know, that's a good question. Can you, can you get into the ambulance? I, nah, it doesn't look like you can. You go into the back of it. <gasps> oh my god, yes, you can. <laughs> you can. Thank you, Austin. We have a diff in here. Med bag. Don't see anything else except like top of side. You know. And a stretcher for So yeah, I'll see you all in the next episode. Have a great day. See ya.